In this episode, we're going to focus on Inspect Shell. Inspect Shell is an interactive session that allows you to explore Inspect resources and controls on your local workstation, a remote target, or even a cloud provider. Let's get started. All right, I'm going to run Inspect version to show Inspect's version on my current system. Now I'm going to run Inspect Shell to launch that interactive session that I was talking about. Here we are inside of here, and help is the first command that you want to use to orient yourself to the environment. You'll see there's another command called help resources. Help resources is going to show you all the resources that Inspect provides. Hmm, here's the file resource. So let's look at information about the file resource. And I'm going to create one of those resources around the file path readme.md. I'm going to see if that file exists. I can also look at the content of that file. Now I'm going to run the ever important exit command when I'm done with the shell. Inspect Shell also has the ability to target a remote machine. So here I'm using SSH with a user and a host name and a password to connect to a Linux instance. You'll note that the name of the system and the family show more information. So let's take a look at the package resource. The package resource allows us to specify a package name. Here I'm going to see the package git to see if it's installed. And I can even ask about its version. Inspect is also able to launch a shell using WinRM. Here I'm specifying the administrator on this Windows machine using a very similar password. Again, I'm going to see the system information about this. This time, let's look at a different resource, OS underscore ENV. This allows us to look at environment variables on my platform. So I'm going to look at a very common one, which is our path variable. I'm going to look at the content of that path. And there's even a little helper method inside of OS ENV called dot split. And this will show me all the path values broken out. We can also use inspect shell to target a Docker instance. So here I'm running Docker PS to find my Docker container ID, and then I specify inspect shell targeting Docker with that same ID. I'm now actually inside of the Habitat Studio running Habitat version 0.54. Well, actually, let's use the command resource. And in this case, I looked at the help for that. And now I'm going to run the command and look at the standard out generated from that. I can see that this is indeed Habitat 0.54. Here we're going to use Inspect Shell to connect to our cloud provider AWS in the US East 1 region. We're going to ask for help on the AWS EC2 instance resource. Here are a few examples. I'm going to use one of the ID values of one of the workstations that I was connecting to previously. So here I'm building out an AWS EC2 instance. I'm pasting in that instance ID. And now I'm going to ask, is that machine running? And of course, I was connected to it before, so it's returning true. But I can also ask for other information, like what is it running on? In this case, the size of the instance. And I can even ask, what virtual private network does it belong to? If you're interested in learning more about Inspect, check out other videos in this series our documentation, or our tutorials.